hello dear traders if you love scalping this video is for you uh, i'm going to show you how that you can scalp the market on the one minute time frame using uh, this strategy that i commonly talk about it is my main strategy i can say uh, i have an arrow on the screen i'll be showing i'll be using it to show you stuff around as i explain this strategy okay so please watch till the end and take your time so that you understand this the strategy is simple if you know it uh you'll be able to easily understand so the first thing you have the rsi right down there uh, maybe i can show the settings and the at the end uh, first thing that you do you wait for price to touch uh, the 90 line level you wait for price to touch the 90 line level on the rsi first and you can even move price on the rsi to see if it is not moving away from the the 90 line level okay once you are sure that price is not moving away uh, you identify the point on the chart that corresponds with the one that has touched the 90 line level on the rsi and once you have identified that you identify the key level before this highest point and it is this swing low okay let's do this it is this swing low so this swing low is your key level you mark it like that let me show you you mark your key level like that now once price close below this key level in a full candle you sell you sell and you target short moves okay let me show you another thing uh, remember what i said price it's as if let me just use an arrow right here on the rsi it's as if price has touched the 10 line level but the moment you play around with it, it moves away from the 10 line level, which means it's not a real signal. Okay, what you want is a real signal like like the one we have right now. Let me see if I can shift this arrow like the one that we have right here where the arrow is pointing when i play around with it it doesn't repaint okay so you identify that uh, even on the screen let's use another arrow uh, it is this point it is this point right here price has touched the 90 line level at that point on the screen okay now you identify the key level before that any area that was respected by price uh, before price got to this key level first is this one okay this is a key level when price got here you can see that it reacted on this key level even on its way up it reacted on this key level so when price was here you could have identified that key level like you could have identified that key level like this like that so when price closed above that key level right here you could have taken a buy okay you take a buy you put your stop loss um, you put your stop loss slightly below that key level okay like that you can even put your stop loss below the swing low or just below this uh, key level that you have drawn so it's like that you take the trade right where the arrow is pointing you might even enter a second trade when price comes to test the key level but it's always safe to take one trade and then you hold it 
and take price he should have targets in this don't be too greedy seeing that the strategy works don't try to triple your account in one day here is another signal that is valid on the rsi or is it the one we identified no it's a different one okay uh, let me just show you we'll take this as the last example so on the rsi we have this part that touched the 10 line level and when you move it back and forth like this it is not repainting and on the screen it corresponds with corresponds with this uh, lowest part okay corresponds with that lowest part so what do you do you identify the key level before that you identify the key level before that and it is let's mark it clearly it is this key level let me mark the whole of it where were we okay it is this key level see how price see how price reacted when it got to this place where the arrow is pointing it reacted on its way down so when price closes above this key level that is where you take a sell and you put your stop loss just below that key level your stop loss just below that key level if you have a, a decent balance you can put it right below the lowest point but it is okay just below the key level that you have drawn and then you hold it uh, a little bit as you can see you could have caught that move it works guys i have a guy who is always sending me screenshots about how they are making money it's several of them are sharing testimonials of this thing it works please uh, this is sunday you can check this throughout the the currency pairs that you have and see how that it works okay see how that it works um, or else am i li leaving out the settings the settings are very simple settings are very simple i haven't been trading on this for quite some time okay uh you have the rsi and the moving envelopes or maybe let me just delete all of them and start afresh because it's been a while since i sent settings for this strategy okay so you have a clean screen right now what you do is you come to this f function mm, once you are here you can also use this f f button up there and once you are here you start with the rsi uh, where is the relative strength index relative strength index uh, this is mt4 right here relative strength index period one applied to close uh, remember for this strategy on the levels you only need the 10 line level and the 90 line level okay you can ignore the rest the 50 line level is only for your take profit okay once you have done that you go back you go back and then you click done you have your rsi now you come to the f button again on indicator window one this time not on the main chart you click right here on indicator window one so i click and then i go to envelopes it is right here envelopes and on the envelopes just copy the settings as they are period one uh, method is smooth and you copy just this thing that you see don't put your own things guys it will become a different strategy okay so once you have done this you click done so you have your indicator right there go and scalp the market it works on every time frame every time frame be dedicated do the back testing long enough it's surprising that i can have a strategy that works for me and i give you and it doesn't work for you i don't know how forex operates it requires that you do your own hard work
for you to get familiar with the markets. So please don't be lazy. Don't think, oh, this is too easy. I'm going to be able to do it. It's not. Be dedicated enough. Do a lot of uh, backtesting. Scroll back and see if it is consistent. See if you are able to identify uh, the key levels, okay? Play around this thing long enough, long enough until you can tell that you can do this, you can do this, okay? So right there you could have taken a cell and you put your stop loss uh, just above the key level. Your stop loss should be just above the key level. See how that you could have caught that downward movement. Okay, so please take some time and practice this. It works. It works. Much love. Have a good evening.